Hey what's up guys Johnny here I'm back with more Call of Duty Mobile today in today's video we look at the battle pass and the premium battle pass for Call of Duty Mobile so it is pre-season one the game went in soft launch in Canada and Australia and they have a pre-season one premium pass and premium pass plus so the price is 800 cut points for the premium pass and 2000 cut points for the premium pass plus so how much money does it mean let's check the shop real quick if you go in the shop and you want to buy cut points the top right you see 800 cut points is actually 9.99 i'm pretty sure it's in canadian because uh my my account is in canada and 2000 cut points on the bottom left is 24.99 25 bucks basically so the premium pass 9.99 and the premium pass plus 24.99 so what's the difference between two and what do you get this preseason along the way? Now the difference between the two battle pass is if you buy the cheapest one, you start at tier one and then you play, you do challenges and you unlock rewards as you progress. If you pay the extra 15 bucks, you start directly at tier 25. So that will save you some time for sure. If you play casual and you think you won't have time to unlock everything, but you want the cool rewards, cool cosmetics and skins, or you have the option at least to pay a little bit more and you can play less to unlock everything. From level 1 to level 100 or tier 1 to tier 100, they give you cut points back. As you can see at tier 15, they give you 20 and there's more. Like there's 20 here and there, are some 25, some 50s. So if you play a lot and you buy the cheapest past and you do everything, well, they give you back the whole 800 cut points. So basically, if every season is 999 or if every season is 800 cut points, if you do the whole season and you do everything, you can buy the next season for free. So unless they change the price, I think it's pretty cool. I did the, the match real quick for real and that's exactly 800 cut points from 1 to 100. Now, if you play a lot and you play even more, once you're done unlocking everything, you can keep progressing. You don't stop playing and then you give you soft currency that you don't waste the rest of the season. You can still play for something at least. Now, just for starting the season and buying the cheapest pass, you'll get these rewards at the start. There's a pretty cool M4 skin here, the G series. All the G series cosmetics are all green, the green team like that. You got a crazy cool knife also, the fire forge. Uh, you got a fire grenade, a red dragon, frag grenades. And you got, I mean, I don't know what that is. I guess it's a its a skin for your character, but uh, I'm new to the game, so I don't know everything yet, but still. And then you start playing, you start doing challenges. And uh, when you get to tier 20, you will get the backpack. The green backpack is the same, uh, same style as the weapon. Now for tier 30, you got April Fool's Day. And you can see a pretty colorful, pretty cool one. You also got the smoke grenades with the colorful style that will fit with the weapon. Same thing for the flashbang at tier 60, you get the colorful flashbang. And then every tier you get some XP cards and uh, cut points and credits and stuff. At tier 70 or reaching tier 60, you got the ASM 10 racing stripes. And you also got a April's full backpack, which is also really nice. The 90 series will give you the G series knife and there's a whole set of G series so you got the knife, you got the weapon, you got the backpack, you got the nades and the last reward for getting to tier 100 is the AK-47 red action and this thing is in the shop by the way. Some of the skins and cosmetics you can buy directly in the shop with your cut points and I think that one is like 1600 points just for that. So I mean it's gonna be my first season, I don't really know how much work it is to get from one to a hundred uh, you got 56 days to do everything and um yeah i don't know what's the progression if like when you advance if the tiers get longer and longer to reach the next one so if you fall short you fall short it kind of sucks but if it's the only game you play and you play a lot um i know in pubg some guys told me it's pretty easy to do everything so it's not worth sometimes paying the extra money just to make sure you get there but yeah um, you guys let me know but also subscribe to the channel because i'll start soon and i will keep you guys updated on the progression uh, and see how hard it is to do the whole thing i'm pretty sure i'll go for it but like i said uh i'm pretty busy i also cover 
uh, Shadowgun Legends, so I'm not playing this game uh, 16 hours a day, but I'll go for it, guys, and I'll let you guys know. So, once again, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hit the like if you did. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more Call of Duty Mobile. I will be back soon. Till then, watch my other videos. Take care. Uh, <clears throat> is this the Havana map? Dude, I only played a few games. Looks like Havana. I don't know. No, this is not the one. I don't even know how to sprint also. Like, sometimes it just walks and sometimes it just starts sprinting. 3v1? Yeah, sure, I can do that. What the frick, man? How did I get three guys in my face on the first second of the game? There's another dude. UAV recon standing by. Repeat, UAV recon is standing by. UAV uh -oh. online. This is not good, dude. This is not good. Looks like I'm alone versus five guys. Keep getting like three guys on my face all the time. What the frick? So I got UAV. Gonna try to take advantage. We lost the lead. Oh yeah, this is not my map. Target Two v one again. I need to stick with my teammates. I think. It's too close. Like I'm gonna stick with this guy. He's shooting at something. So at least if I'm with my guys, I'm not gonna be like 2v1 again, like every, every... Gucci gang! Oh! Bullet force rules. Dude, this is not bullet force! Alright. Come back up. Oh, there's voice chat. Do you guys hear me? It's up, team. Enemy UAV spotted. Enemy UAV. I'm in trouble, and I'm alone again. I need to get with my squad. <laughs> Shot in the back. Okay, hit with the 999. Thank you for the super chat. You rock, my dude. We tied for the lead. And yeah, this is not bullet force. Repeat, this is not bullet force. It's COD Mobile released yesterday in soft launch. <laughs> In a few countries. He's the lead. Some guys uh, are over there. Oh, is it not dead? There's a guy in there. It's too close. Fight harder. Frank. I didn't say Frank, by the way. We lost oh, this the lead. dude. We lost the lead. Dude, I'm carrying the team right now. I walk along. Gaming with Joshi with the super chat. Bro. Enemy down. Enemy down. Repeat. Action over there. Don't die, boys. UAV recon ready for deployment. Tied for the lead. See, that's what Hunter I said from close range. Hunter killer drone deployed. Oh, that was cheap. UAV online. They're all there. We've taken the lead. Predator missile awaiting orders. This is so cheap, man. The, the flamethrower in the face. You don't deserve UAV a sandwich. Online. We lost the lead. UAV online. Guys. Heads up. Enemy UAV spotted. Heads up, team. Spot Enemy this, dude. UAV spotted. It's too close. Fight harder. Target down. Alright, this is not a good the lead. Pick it up, team. Standing by. Bro, I'm UAV struggling. UAV recon is standing by. Hunter killer drone on standby. Predator missile inbound. We've taken the lead. Taken the lead. Friendly hunter killer.
drone deployed. UAV online. Whoops. Kill streak for the win. I'm camping, man. I don't want to camp. Killer drone inbound. They're hurting. Keep fighting. Hostile predator missile. What's the inbound. score? UAV online. 39-32. Kill camp. It's a win, boys. That was a good game, man. But dude, my tongues are are freaking sweaty.